today is a funny day. It's kind of been raining and then the sun kind of peeks out and then it's cloudy again. So I thought I'd come for a walk through Dollar Tree. I do need a couple items, so I thought I'd film for you guys and see what's new today. Well, here's the back to school display. Everything seems to be put out. New little back to school planners. Oh, this one is actually a really cute layout. It's very simple. And very fine lines. I'm very particular about my lines. I don't like big fat lines in my notebooks or my calendars. Cute unicorn. these bigger packs than normal? Yeah, see? Usually it's the smaller packs. Cute little eraser packs. This goes very well with the theme that's going on these couple months. All the meteor meteors and they're all these are great containers, especially if you're a teacher and you need to set up the little cubby containers for kids' shoes. I love that they have a handle. These are different. Little scratch stickers. Who doesn't love to scratch? Scratch off sticker. Oh my gosh, too cute. So these paper pads made by Jot are actually a new line and I just saw them pop up at another Dollar Tree so here they are and you're able to, I'm able to flip through this one because somebody's broke the seal. Lots of notebooks. The thing is you do have to be careful with the price like we pay $1.25 here for these notebooks but you can get notebooks at Walmart or Staples sometimes for 5 to 10 cents. So if you're not particular about the front covers, I love these. These are so practical up top over like the hook, over a cubby hook or something like that. Ooh, I like the binders. Really colorful, nice pale purple. I am obsessed with purple lately. I've been using all my purple pens and all my purple things when I'm writing out my plans. I really like these binders. Don't need one. These are new and you can easily turn them into loop bags. I always like the idea of being able to repurpose something, so material like that can definitely be repurposed. Wow, these here are sell for ten dollars. Seven ninety nine to fourteen ninety nine at Mastermind Toys. to see what it comes with. Yeah, so five markers and 18 coloring pages. Wow.
these are new little wall hooks oh how cute for like a little girl's washroom or even in your craft room has anyone used them? have you found them to be sturdy little hooks? These are new to me. Uh, just the front one. These are new. Stickers always get me. I really like these ones, they're super cute. Let's see if there's anything that catches. Oh, these are new as well here. I kind of am on top of what's new because I I have pretty much all these stickers here so it's easy for me to spot when there are new ones. I've done a full tour before if you want to see of like all the stickers and the craft aisle. Well this is new. Has anyone used this little craft and glue remover? Looks handy. Especially for sticker removal and stuff like that. These sequin trims are new. This is fantastic if you're making, oh my goodness, pocket letters and anything that involves ribbons and tassels. These are also kind of new to me. I love using these for DIYs. I've made so many cute things on the channel using these frames. It's a little unicorn. I'd seen the mermaid before, but this one is new to me. I didn't think that this was going to come to our stores. I'm not sure how I feel about this line because I know a lot of the crafting communities such as the Cricut and Silhouette users make things like this with Dollar Tree product. Oh my gosh, these are cute too. So I'm not really sure how I feel. Does anyone have an opinion on seeing these types of custom designs?
this one more. I know. They're gross. No. Oh, these would be great for DIYs, making those little cotton, you know what I mean, the cotton plants? What are they called? There's a name for them. These are new. Blessed and thankful. Super trendy. Very farmhouse. These are new. Looks like they were just put out. 15 little tablets. Never used anything like that in our bathtubs, but I think it'd be fun for kids. This is new as well. It's all in selectives. We have tried this hair dye in purple in Scarlett's hair, and it did not work at all. Oh, I think these are new back splash tiles. I may be wrong, but I feel like that one is new. There are some ice packs. I know somebody was looking for them. So there's two sizes right now, the larger and the smaller ice pack, depending how big your cooler or lunch bag is. And then sometimes there's like flexible ones, which I don't see here today. So I have a couple of these set up for the kids for school supplies. So they have like their staples, a sharpener, pencils, and stuff like that. So they each can pull them out when they're doing homework study. But I love that those were white. I didn't see those back then. And see, now there's none of the colored ones. And I have a red and a blue one. They chose their colors. I would have preferred to have white. But I don't even see them in any other color here.
Oh, these are new. And they look like way better quality than the typical ones you see. Very cute. This one is nice and thick. I'm going to go through these and see if there's any that would be good for my bathroom. I like this one. This is my first time actually seeing bath towels. Wow, full on bath towels. I bet you these are gonna sell it so quickly the next time I'm here, they're gonna be all gone. Nice black towel is good for makeup removing or even if you have your hair dyed. These are so cute. Oh, and they're so nice and heavy. Perfect for a desk with your little pens. I wish they weren't so fluorescent green. Hope you guys enjoyed walking through the store with me today. I do look very forward to sharing a haul with you. And until next time, everyone, have a wonderful day. Thanks so much for watching. Bye for now.